hey guys welcome back to the next video and in this video i will show you or rather give you an overview of uh, data manager so over here in the navigation you have the first section is app overview which is basically taking us to the uh, at the front front page of the app from where we can choose the sheet and all which we have already seen um, but for now let me click on this data manager so once i click on the data manager you can see that on the very first section it is showing us the table which we have imported it earlier if you want to add more table or data we can click over here add and add more tables similarly if you see uh, over here we have uh, related to this table we have all the fields uh, which we can see and uh, we can scroll it left and right to see it so see basically all the fields um, over here you have the option to add it edit this table refresh this table or reload it so that if there is any addition or removal of the data in the back end it will be refreshed it accordingly if you want to delete it delete it and if there is any filter then you can cancel the filter a couple of other options like view details so for now let's go ahead and click on the edit this table just to give you a quick overview now edit this table opens up in a new window and here we have the option like this if you are seeing uh, if I go over over to general and if I click over here we can do basically rename we can sort we can view the detail so let's click on rename and I can now in, instead of having a space let's say I want the underscore right so I can make that underscore and just click somewhere else like I have just clicked on order date and now this is done but as you can see instead of going here and doing a rename I can simply click here and do the rename right and uh, apart from this as you can see I have the option of sorting in case I want to sort the data and I have the option of viewing the detail let's click on view the detail so it shows that it's a sort field it's order date and no operation is done you can close it all right so you can perform all of this operation on all of these different tables now after this you have the option of unpivot let's say you have a structure which you have imported in a pivot kind of structure and you want to unpivot it because uh, you want in a long format and uh, from the visualization perspective then you can unpivot the data after that you have uh, the option of uh, adding a field so for example based on certain calculation you want to add a field you can add it and that's the most commonly used operation because business needs keeps increasing when they see the first output they want more and more and uh, n number of times you will have to create a calculated field so that option will be very very helpful so i wanted to show you after that you have the option to select data from the source in case you want to select it so once it is done you can come over here you can click on this which is done right and uh, basically see whatever changes that you have made like uh, order data order date underscore everything is done after that uh, you have so this is basically an association view in case uh, there is an association between the tables but if you want to just have the table view you can click on table and it will show you the table so right now it is showing pending update because we have not loaded the data after making the changes once we will load the data it will work it will gonna work absolutely fine so let's go ahead and load the data and see how it is coming in the front end and click on edit this sheet and uh, go to fields now if you see order underscore id and order underscore date right so if you again want to make some changes go to navigation come to data manager and select the view in which you are more comfortable and uh, start making the changes into the data by going over here in the edit so that's a quick overview of uh, data manager within ClickSense and I will now meet you in the new video with a new topic.